Hello and welcome to Charlotte Motor Speedway for today's running of the Bank of America Roval 400. So it is the only current road course on the LNCS racing schedule here. So the first road course of the season is our second to last race here as Homestead Miami will be season finale to finish out season three so we have a full field 36 drivers ready to go racing here to see who can take home the checkered flag here at Charlotte and so we get ready to go racing here we'll take a look at some of headlines from today's race William Byron is on the pole looking for his first win here in the LNCS. Alex Bowman starting second. Still looking to capture that first win. Jimmy Johnson up there in points. Looking to see if he can get his first win here in this series. Joey Logano. A little farther down there in points. Looking to make up some ground. Don't know if he'll be able to get enough to win the championship. Matt Kenseth. A strong run at Bristol. Can he continue here a few races later? Martin Truex Jr., also a threat there in the championship. See if he can run well today. And Ryan Blaney. See if he can capture the checkered flag here at the Roval. And Kyle Busch, who's struggled a little bit more this season. We'll see if he can rebound a little more. And Chase Elliott, your points leaders. Coming in, we'll see if he can take home the checkered flag. Daniel Hamrick, last race's winner, looking to have another solid run today. As the field gets ready to roll off, we'll take a look at your starting lineup for today's race. In row one, it's William Byron and Alex Bowman. In row two, Joey Logano and Jimmy Jam, seven time Johnson. In row three, Clint Boyer and Kevin Happy Harvick. In row four, Matt Kenseth and Martin Truix Jr. In row five, Ryan Blaney and who's outside Paul Menard. In row six, Brad Kozlowski and Chris Buescher. Row seven, Daniel Suarez and Ryan Priest. Row eight, Tarek Jones and Eric Almarola. In row nine, Kyle Busch and Matt DiBenedetto. Row ten, Chase Elliott and Daniel Hamrick. In row eleven, Ricky Stenhouse Jr. and Michael McDowell. In row twelve, Kurt Busch and Ryan Newman. In row thirteen, Bubba Wallace and who's outside Corey LaJoy. Row fourteen, David Reagan and Denny Hamlin. Row 15, Ty Dillon, to his outside, his brother, Austin Dillon. In row 16, Cody Ware and Landon Castle. Row 17, BJ McLeod and Matt Tift. In row 18, Ross Chastain and Quinn Hoff. And that is your starting lineup for today's race. So... It's an eight-lap race, penultimate race of the season, and William Byron is on the pole. And green flags in the air as William Byron takes him down. Alex Bowman there slides in the second as Joey Logano's in third. Has to come back up to turns one and two of the oval. William Byron continues the lead. He goes to the inside there. Bowman tries to look on the outside, but doesn't get anything. Still trying to look to his inside now and gets him through there. Yes, take lap two. So Alex Bowman's now in the lead here. William Byron's still trying to stay behind him there. William Byron's going to look to his inside now as they come into the backstretch scheme. And there we go. William Byron takes the lead from Alex Bowman. So William Byron continues to lead there with that front stretch scheme. So we start lap three. Starting to pull away now a little bit from Alex Bowman. Field continues to fly through the inner part of the course as Jimmy Johnson's 
Moving up towards the front, making the pass on Joey Logano there for third. Mark Bowman still in second as they come through the front stretch clean. Start lap four as Jimmy Johnson's trying to catch the leaders. And you got a wreck here in the back of the pack. As it looks like both Dillon brothers here go around. Caution on lap four as well as Cody Ware there being involved. Take a look at the replay. Looks like the brakes locked up or something to Cody Ware's car. Gets into the back of him. Gets into Ty Dillon. Just gets into Austin. So two brothers aren't happy as it looks like both of them are going to be done for the day after they try to repair it. And we'll get a restart here on lap six of eight. And green flags back in the air as William Byron leads him down. Alex Bowman loses that second position as Jimmy Johnson takes it. So Jimmy Johnson's looking to his teammate, William Byron, there to try to get first. Comes to the inside off of old turn two. Down to the that stretch cane and he gets the pass made. Jimmy Johnson is now your leader here at Charlotte Roval as we have a white flag in the air. One more lap. Can Jimmy get it done? Here comes Joy Logano up to second place. Trying to catch Jimmy Johnson. Will he have enough here? About half a lap to go. Jimmy Johnson's pulling away here. Through the backstretch cane. Off of oval turn four. Through the last cane. And Jimmy Johnson is going to win here at the Charlotte Roval. Jimmy Johnson gets his first ever career win here in the LNCS. As he will do his burnout here. Jimmy Johnson is finally able to capture that checkered flag for the first time in this series. So we'll take a look at your finishing results for today's race. Congrats to IDK Fan 12 and Jimmy Johnson on winning today's race. So you can take a look at the rest of the finishing results here. So it was a very exciting race here at Charlotte. It's usually can be a lot of action-packed hope you all enjoyed it so a little update here as homestead will be your race next week or well next race basically probably will take longer than a week for it to come out but that will be our season finale so one last race to see who will be crowned the champion here in season three and then season four will hopefully Come out here later this year. Probably be at least a month's gap in between the seasons um, before that starts. So, hope you guys enjoyed the race today. And we'll get to take a look here at your point standings. So, a look at your point standings here. As Jimmy Johnson has now moved to the top. Chase Elliott second and Martin Truex Jr. in third so still a tight points battle if you guys could still win it here as they go into homestead the final race of the season so thank you everybody for watching today's race hope you enjoyed it it's always exciting here at the charlotte roval and thank you for watching today's race and we'll see you next time at Homestead Miami Speedway for the championship race as we will crown our season three champion. So be sure to be there to check what, that one out. And for everyone here at LNCS, this is Corey Klatt signing off.